So today's cocktail is called the Velvet Mark. We're going to use a cactus pear, which is, you can sort of start to find in stores. In the next two weeks, you'll definitely start to see some, uh, some produce come into the grocery stores and you'll be able to get them as well. And as well as we'll be using some fresh mint leaves and a little bit of sugar and of course, Maker's Mark bourbon. So I think you're really going to enjoy this. It's a really nice, very smooth, flavorful cocktail and all the flavors really work well together. So you can build this either in a martini glass or you can put it right on rocks uh, in a glass as well. First we need to do is get that cactus pear all together so we're able to muddle this all together with the mint leaves. So I've already done that uh, already, is to sort of put the cactus pear cut off the, uh, you have to be very careful when you're handling cactus pear because it is the spines that will prick you. Uh, a good tip, if they do get in your fingers, you can either use Elmer's glue and let it dry and then actually peel it off or if you're in a jam and you don't have Elmer's glue, you can use duct tape or any sort of really sticky uh, tape will actually help pry it up. So we're going to remove the skin, put it in uh, and I've just sort of put it in our glass. Then what we're going to do is we're going to add a spoonful of sugar and you can use raw brown sugar or white granulated sugar. The important part of using the sugar is it helps break apart uh, all the fresh ingredients that we're putting with the cactus pear and the mint leaves. And then for the mint leaves we're going to use about six large mint leaves. I've already got them off the stem and we're just going to give them a smack to wake them up, release some of the flavors and put those, I'll usually rip them in half and put them right inside and then we'll grab our trusty muddle we have quite a big, nice big one and we'll just push down and twist so be careful because the cactus pear, if you get a really nice ripe one, it is quite juicy and we're just mixing up all the flavors as we muddle Once we've done that, wipe off the muddle. Then we're going to add some ice and then I'll add the bourbon. Now we're going to add our Maker's Mug bourbon. And I'll do two ounces. And there we go, delicious. Then I'll shake this up. nice and chilled and I'm going to do a method called double straining. What it is is it goes through your Hawthorne strainer or the one with the metal spring as well as a fine strainer or a mesh strainer and it's just going to remove any sort of pulp or any of our ingredients that you don't want in there so you're just left with a really pure liquid. So the mint leaves will be extracted as well as any of the seeds out of the cactus pear. You can use a spoon to help move it around inside the fine strainer. Once we have that all done, I'll go ahead and add some ice into here. It's nice to use a nice crisp ice so it looks really fresh. And you can add a splash of soda or 7-Up if you like. So 7 Up's going to be a little bit uh, sweeter and add some uh, sugar with soda if you don't want it as sweet. So I'll put just a little splash of soda and then there we have it. Can't forget a sprig of mint as our garnish. And if you put a, a straw right next to it so you always get that nice fresh mint aroma whenever you go to take a sip. There you have it. Our Velvet Mark is our cocktail of the week. I hope you enjoy it as much as I have. I hope we have a good week. We'll talk to you again soon. Cheers.